It's further up. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> no, he, he flopped out of the screen, or like onto my face cam. Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> he literally crawled out of the screen, basically exactly where my face cam is, and then does that. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we may have one of the greatest killer designs in Dead by Daylight history right in front of our eyes. Oh my goodness. Alright. Oh, we go from the cool new map... The area of crows. I'm not sure if this will be the first one on YouTube or the second one or whatever. Um, but the first one unfortunately had no sound and was kind of short and uneventful anyway. So and we couldn't do the more either, so. Let's go for it now. I do wonder how I look like movement-wise. Like how I look when approaching. Hello. The way he lashed out is very weird though. I didn't hit her. Um, like the way he swings, you know. Also, wait, it's Toxic Mama Gaming. Why did I misread it so hard in the lobby? That's far the first impression. I mean, obviously, I've only played like one game this far, and again, the main impressions will come once it's on the live servers. Like, the design is 10 out of 10. The gameplay thus far feels very fun too. Okay, we hit that. Let's go. Oh. Oh, that didn't hit. Again, if I would have hit him here, there would have been an injury. Okay, the cool thing is. Yeah, teleport is so fast and you know within the blink of an eye you, you just go from one part of the map to another right here aha aha that didn't hit that's terrible dudes that's so bad Holy shit. That's what I meant earlier. You can do witchcraft now. Oh my god. Where'd you go? She can literally perform like a ritual. And once it's finished, like, all gens get progress or some shit. You know what? We'll do your witches. Do your... Do your little... Mystery things. Okay, but that teleport is insane. Holy shit. Like, dredge teleport, especially outside of Nightfall, is, like, so slow. This is, like, in an instant. It's, like, literally the blink of an eye. That's so strong. Now, again, I wanna... Hell yeah, that's what... That's how it's, that's how it's done. You hit them once, you injure them once, and then boom. And it remains. It goes away over time, so it's, like, you know... It's, like, after a while. I will ignore the other person for now, though. I do think it can bounce a bit. Like, I did read that it apparently has a bit of a bounce mechanic, too. Ah! It's not easy to hit. It really isn't. The way it flies... With a bit of a delay, or maybe it's a new mouse, I'm not sure, but it's really not easy. Out it. Like, it does seem like a definitely cool chase power. Oh, wait, did it... Didn't, I think it didn't hit her, I think it only hit her airborne. The explosion needs to hit her, that's what needs to, needs to hit.
Went upstairs. So you can over here. Nice. Okay, don't forget, we can teleport. They do can remove those hallucinations, I'm sure. Oh wait, it went away again already. That's so fast. What? She broke my ankles! Bro. She broke my fucking ankles. Hold on, though. I think I can surprise her a bit. Surprise! I mean, not really a big surprise, but... Jesus Christ, dude. How long have we been chasing her? I mean, now she's down. Hallelujah. To be fair, I wanted to try to chase a bit, you know. And if you are good with the ability, it's definitely helpful. But on the other end, it's definitely more about the hallucinations that really makes it, for sure. Actually, you do have a nice range, though. Actually, not even gonna lie. And I teleported right in front of her. Ah, that didn't hit. She dodged it. She, you can dodge it pretty well. It's, it's, it's definitely a ability that requires skill to hit and dodge. I really love that. But obviously, if you have to loop, you can't dodge it, and that's where you go down. Nice. Okay, so gameplay-wise, also really fun. And different. I'm a big fan. Obviously, though, we need to keep in mind we want to get a... Mori. I hindered her. Even though I didn't tag her, I hindered her, so she got slow. <laughs> you want some candy? Jesus. Oh, hold on. Oh, if I could turn on detectable. Oh. Oh, that's so terrifying! Because it's so fast! Fuck yeah! I love that. That is so cool. And I mentioned so many, too. Again, you can't plant them. It happens over time. But I honestly like that. Oh my god. I have so many of them. I actually like that a lot. Oh, I was here. Um, You know, both the hallucinations spawning and the ability they have on their head right now. This, this purple thing. Going away after time too. Great, great design, great killer, fun chase. Looks a bit laggy right now, but yeah, I'm a huge fan. This is extremely enjoyable. And like mentioned, the way you teleport is fucking terrifying in the best way possible. Jesus. Oh, wow, I actually hit him. That range is actually kind of crazy. I wonder how far it can go. Oh, wow, it's actually like a little missile. That's so fucking fun. And obviously, that also means you can hit like three people at the same time. You can technically damage four people at once. You tag four of them at the same time, and then you hit them all at once. But yeah, I've let you live for long enough already now. I think it's time to end your misery. Inner healing? On my server. <laughs> they got head on! You're gonna die for that! Okay, Mori time! Toxic Mama Gaming TTV, you are. Our test subject. Thank you. Okay, let's see. What? What? Oh, shit! <laughs> wow! Thank you, camera angle! Incredible! Incredible Mori showcase! Incredible! 
Holy fucking shit, dude. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, we gotta do that again. <laughs> it literally blocked everything. But okay, it opens its its back parts, which I was actually surprised we didn't like. You know, wasn't really part of the power. Actually, never mind. Isn't this where this projectile is coming out of? I think this is where we are, you know, blursting our thing from. Oh, it didn't hit at all. Getting hitbox is really not easy. Jesus. Okay, best way to hit it is when they're trying to go for 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 windows. I mean, obviously, if you not if you don't hit it. Oh wow. Okay. Were you dead on hook too? You weren't. Fuck. Man, how fucking unfortunate! Okay, you saw that. I can. I was just able to go to the exit gate instantly like that. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. I'm sorry, Clover Leduc, but like any of you, I need another Mori. I cannot accept the Mori I just saw. Nah, 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 nah. Not! I'm sorry, but I cannot allow that. Now, another one. Okay, this one looks better. Oh, that's so sick! Oh my god! Yeah, man, the Mori got blocked entirely. I was like, oh my god, this looks so cool already. Then, when the big part that we just saw happened, I literally just saw just saw sand. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, but that Mori is instantly incredible. Holy moly. That Mori is terrifying, creative, and brutal. You would fucking love to see it. Yeah, I first saw nothing. Then I did see a bit. And then I saw only... The bottom of the map so that was a bit unfortunate but now the second one worked perfectly hell yeah okay wow this killer is fantastic focus on your challenges and whatnot then things are feeling much better oh this map is very fitting because again he is a apparently a failed military experiment so to say or like to put him into hawkins that is incredibly fitting Again, unfortunately, I couldn't play the new map one more time. Or maybe I will... <sighs> or maybe I will try to... Yeah, this is a perfect setting one. Um, I will try to get a map offering. Okay, it's not that far. Um, try to get a map offering and play that map one more time so I have three cool long rounds with the new killer for the channel and leave the first one out. Yeah, it is kind of unfortunate I didn't have that one now for, you know. Um, you know that I probably won't be uploading that one now for the channel because obviously there was the first impression on the power. Well, I mentioned no audio kind of sucks, you know. Oh my god, it bounced more than I wanted to. Uh. Yeah, but he's definitely not too strong in chase. I am undetectable right now, though. Might be able to sneak up on someone. And it's long, too. Hello! 
That's a long undetectable period. And again, this is a huge map, so we have like, you know, the teleporting here is very powerful. Oh my god, someone once again did that ritual in the basement. Everybody's trying that shit out, I can't believe it. Again, I find it lame because it's just gen rushing, you know. Finally, I saw her. Why well, can keep her stuck in this part? Nice. Okay, that's strong. That feels good. Into the basement you go. And then we instantly teleport somewhere. You can instantly teleport. You can instantly be from basement to completely opposite of the map. Watch it. Holy fucking shit. That's actually so cool. That feels amazing. And again, the only way it disappears is if the survivors do it. So like, you know. If they don't do it. Then it will remain. It's completely up to them whatever I can teleport a lot or not. We were here earlier. And <laughs> now you're kind of trapped there. My little fish. <laughs> okay, that's it. That's disgustingly strong now actually. If you if you find situations like that, it's powerful. That's, wh that's where the power actually shines. If you can corner them in the corner like that, there's no escape. You will get them. So that feels great. But again, it's a very specific situation, a very specific corner of the map, so... I think, you know, thus far I really can't call this too strong or whatever. Okay, this might be one of the coolest abilities in the game. Such an instantly fast teleport with such a cool unsettling sound effect on top of that is so fucking dope. Oh, I was so undetectable. That's why she didn't hear me. That perk is actually kind of nice with the undetectable, huh? That perk with the undetectable is nice because again what happens is you transfer your terror radius um, to a specific gen so everybody will hear it around there but then you become undetectable for like 30 seconds it's so long now imagine you do that on Myers Imagine your tier 3 Myers getting 30 seconds of undetectable. And again, it was able to instantly teleport away. And be here now. That's... Oh. This killer is just a blast to play, generally. Well, again, I have time. Okay, that feels very good. I mean, in this moment, you need to kind of, you know, um, commit, I guess. But, like, yeah, that definitely... If you're unprepared for it, can definitely catch you off guard. You can just corner them, you can wait it out, and then boom. Just do it with that. Which actually makes me wonder... Um... How this hallucination aspect came in because I think they just really wanted an hallucination aspect for the killer. Because like you know it's like kind of the whole thing about hallucinating and that's basically what we Oh. And it's basically what we did the entire time with um E. Um in the trailers too, you know, it was all about those hallucinations. Um, so that was their thought process of, okay, that's what we can do with the hallucinations to put it into the power. Make the teleportation aspect. 
And it makes sense too, because obviously, like we mentioned, the entire part of the lore is um, that he just abducts things from one place or another without leaving a trace. So to have a extremely fast teleport like that is a very fitting. Sadly. Damn, she basically ran into me there. <laughs> that is insane. Oh, I'm feeling like a little kid. Oh, this makes me so happy. Oh, that's so fun. I hit her here. She runs away from me. She's like in terror, no idea where to go. And then I just, in the blink of an eye, appear right in front of her. She literally runs around the... Like, she looks behind her, looks out for me, waiting for where I'm coming for her. And then she runs around the corner and I'm right in her face. That's so fucking incredible. That's like the best teleport in the entire game already. Like, immediately. And it's like, not even close. Yeah, this is how you get rid of them. Which means you've obviously to spend time on that. Ah, she dropped into it! Oh, this killer is so much fun! Oh, I love it! Oh, I love it so much. It's instantly one of my favorite killers, both in terms of design and gameplay. It's such a blast. It's such a blast, holy moly. And now I'm undetectable. Oh, I ne never even looked at his little feet. I'm undetectable. You can't hear me. Where are you? There you are. And again. Oh, we did it again! Oh my god, I'm feeling like a little kid! Oh, this is so incredible! Oh my god, this killer is so fun! Holy shit! Oh, I mean, okay, that's once again the angle of all angles. But, um... <laughs> I mean, again, this is a bad angle, I'm sorry, but... <laughs> hey, you're in the middle of this. <laughs> Holy shit, man. This teleport is the best thing ever. Teleporting in front of survivors like that is so fucking cool. Oh. It does kind of get um, difficult with... Um, you know. With um, finding the right... Uh, or like immediately knowing where you are, angle-wise. You know what I mean? Okay, this is a much better place. Lovely. Oh, it's so cool. Hey, did she just point in my butthole? Holy shit. I wonder how it looks like actually from third person view. Whoa, what? Oh, she had endurance. But as if I would mind. Oh. Mess up the. No! <laughs> <laughs> it's a cherry on top. How did I not hear it actually? Oh man. Oh my god, this killer is incredible. Oh my god, this killer is incredible. Uh, to watch the game, play it on YouTube. So much fun. 
idea to actually... Actually, too, the crawling would have been also pretty dope to have in other instances as well. Maybe after you teleport or something. Um, but, oh man, I haven't had that much fun with Killer in a while.